I think Pokemon the TV series is so underrated. I hear a lot of people who just hated it or say it's so stupid. But I think beyond the simplicity of the show, there are good anime. I am Anime Dreamer and this is Pokemon Retrospective. I'm not exaggerate when I say that the first 12 episodes of Pokemon are the best 12th episode in any show over 100 episode ever. Think of show like Doctor Who that starts slowly making the methods of the show slowly for years or anime like Naruto and One Piece that take them so long to make us know what the show all about. Take Pokemon 12th episode only to set the ground for over 850 episodes and 17 movies. Pokemon is directed by Kunihiko Yoyama. I will not act like other reviewers online and go depth into the cast. I do not know anyone in the cast but Yoyama and that for two anime I love a lot but never get popularity in English. Raul Sanshiro and Time Trouble Tondikimon. Both have cartoony comedy and a friendship as a theme. Tondikimon are more common. We will start slowly with the anime. The first few episodes are more important, so I'll talk about them more. But later on, the show will go faster, and each video will cover more episodes. We start with one of the best first episodes in anime history. This episode is one one of how to make first episode in any show. Starting with a song that's so catchy and get us into the show theme, and it's so epic. Show all the great looking Pokemon and characters. Still one of the best anime songs that remade in English. By the way, that edition is the most of the world remakes into their own language. Language. The first episode aired in April 1st, 1997. That make Pokemon 18 years old now. The first scene is great. Show small screen resemble the Game Boy screen that the show based on. But later it turned into Fight for Real that make all kids of the 90s screen. Notice the Pokemon trainer and the screen are in dark. Make them more mysterious and make you want to watch the show to see the cool character and use green ball that make them the cool trainer that use a normal ball that cool. And now, after making you exciting about Pokemons, they show you a boat just like you outside the screen, full of excitement in a room, full of Pokemon things, toys, and everything is Pokemon. Make you not just know that he loved Pokemon just like you, but he loved the idea of Pokemon. One of the greatest idea of Pokemon that the main character is ten, but still go away for, from homeworks and schools to play with cool animals. Kind of play with the kids' uh, fantasy in that regard. Now, after we know the main character, let's see the main rival. The show did didn't stop for a moment to show how asshole this kid is, making fun of Ash and he have his own cheer squad. Now let me the other star of the show, Pikachu. I think Ash get a Pikachu is the smartest move in the show. In the game there are three options and each is okay and the game try to make it sound like any one of this is the right choice and in the anime they didn't want to make any choice in the game is wrong so they make Ash pick a natural Pokemon, in that case Pikachu. The other smart thing about Pikachu is that he has have his own character. Unlike other shows that have animals, the animal don't have any character outside their own species. But Pikachu have his own character, make him special outside all other Pikachus. And that we'll see more about it in other episodes with other Pokemon that they have own character. Each Pokemon have their own character. Not about the species, but each individual Pokemon have his own character, different from each one of his own species. Now we know the two main characters. We start with the conflict. Pikachu hate Ash guts, and Ash don't like how arrogant Pikachu is. Is. The show starts with the character's flow. Ash and Pikachu are not just 2D characters, but more in depth than that. We know that Ash is lazy and Pikachu have anger management and stubborn sometimes. But note that Ash have no redeeming quality. We see him endangering his life for Pikachu later on, trying to save him. And he gave that epic speech. Pikachu, this can't happen. Get inside. I know you're afraid of going in there, but if you're inside, maybe I can save you. Please, Pikachu, please listen to me and go inside. After that, then, after that, just trust me. Spiros, do you know who I am? I'm Ash from the town of Pallet. I'm destined to be the world's number one Pokemon master. I can't be defeated by the likes of you. I'm going to capture and defeat you all.
and what can I say it's the start of a beautiful friendship and the last scene of the episode Ash see one of the legendary Pokemon in its magnificent scene it added the element of wonder to the show and make you really know this is will be a wonderful journey to watch the show this is the end of episode one of this retro spec I hope you like it and I hope that I make more of these and we enjoy them together and let's have a wonderful journey with Pokemon